welcome everyone. Ant-Man and the Wasp have released in 6 July. Ant-Man and the Wasp is a 2018 American superhero film based on the Marvel Comics characters Scott Lang aka Ant-Man and Hope Van Dyne aka Wasp. Produced by Marvel Studios and distributed by Walt Disney Studios Motion Pictures, it is the sequel to 2015's Ant-Man, and the 20th film in the Marvel Cinematic Universe MCU. Today I am gonna review the Ant-Man and the Wasp movie. And don't worry it is completely spoiler free. Before starting make sure that you have subscribed this channel. Because we publish videos of games and movies regularly. And don't forget to turn on the notification button so you will be notified about this channel. And you enjoy please leave a like and drop your opinion in comment section below. Let's start. Paul Rudd returns as Scott Lang aka Ant-Man in the story of hope and new chances. In the ending of Captain America Civil War the government captured him with other superheroes who support Captain America. But Captain America aka Steve Rogers rescued them all and all of them returns their personal life. After the events of Captain America Civil War, Scott Lang has given up being the Ant-Man to focus on raising his daughter and starting a new business. Estranged from him, Hope Van Dyne Evangeline Lilly and Dr. Hank Pym Michael Douglas have been working underground in a personal project, until an urgent mission emerges and they are forced to team up with Lang once more. In this sequel, Hope Van Dyne absolutely steals the show. We had already seen how brilliant she is, but in this story, she fully explodes her skills as a fighter, a tech genius, and hero. In a fight scene that takes place in a kitchen, action meets comedy delivering the kind of exhilarating scenes we always expect from the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Hank Pym's wife is trapped in Quantum Realm. In this movie Hank works on a project to rescue his wife. In the movie this is the big mission. And along this the government and other also want to rob the Hanks technology. On the other side Ava Starr aka the Ghost and Bill Foster aka the Goliath also want to rescue Hanks wife. But they want to regain the power of Quantum Realm. Their intention is not correct. So our hero Ant-Man and Wasp have to face them and also the other. Peyton Reed movie has everything we love about Ant-Man. Family bonds, friendship, witty gags and thrilling action. There are not many new elements added to the story, but that is not necessarily a bad thing. In simple terms, it means that if you liked the first movie, you are going to like this one too. Reed brings us the characters and elements we already love, now more mature. Like a bottle of good wine, the Ant-Man franchise has gotten better with time. The villain has a credible, realistic, relatable reason to be in conflict with our heroes. There is no end of the world scenario, no villain seeking world domination, but the situations this movie presents are critical and life-threatening for the characters. A conflict that shares a resemblance with the one in Spider-Man Homecoming where the villain was a working-class man trying to support his family, and the final confrontation was intimate, small, yet immensely significant to those involved. IMDb has rated this movie 7.6 out of 10. Rotten Tomato has rated this movie 86% fresh. I rate this movie 8 tomatoes out of 10. After the heartbreaking end of Infinity War, Ant-Man and the Wasp comes to cheer us up with an entertaining, heartwarming and exciting story. Are you watching Ant-Man and the Wasp in this weekend? You can share your opinion in comment section. And again don't forget to like and subscribe. Goodbye. See you next time with a new interesting topic.